Welcome back everyone, Drew here, Beer for Breakfast Facts for Snacks. It is what it is, it's a Saturday, it's beautiful, nice outside, not, it's not snowing and stuff. We're going to do a beer review. And about three, three and a half years ago I was just getting into craft. And I want to say this was the beer. Because I, I drink, I drink, okay, so here, I, I, I have old Milwaukee ice right here, so it's a lager. It's a lager. And I drink lagers because I love lagers. It's easy drinking. goes down good. But I bought this and wanted to try it. And this is what got me into craft beer. And if, and I'm hoping anyone out there watching this, and you do like Old Milwaukee, you do like, you know, I like James Reddy, um, you do like those beers. Get this one. Get this one. It might change your life. Always try something different. I can't explain it enough. We're going to go, you know, Muskoka Craft Lager. It's 4.8% alcohol. Um, like the region it's from, our all malt Muskoka Craft Lager is a, get, uh, is a getaway from the average. That's because it's carefully aged and handcrafted to be uniquely flavorful. Yet remarkably easy drinking. Check the date cold of the beer fresh to blah blah. So it says right here freshest by March 30th, 21. Try something different. I can't express that enough, guys. I can't express it enough. Muskoka Craft Lager. Uh, it's uh, 13 IBU, 3.49 L5 on untapped, with 14,870 ratings uh let's see I mean something here oh it's the same thing yeah so i'm gonna get into this because like i said if you like your average stuff you like you, you like your canadian your budweiser get one of these because now you are supporting local i said these big guys you're going to support excuse me you're going to support craft beer and this is a craft lager it's just a craft lager guys i'm going to test out my new beer glass from flying monkeys i have not used this yet i'm using it with a craft lager why not because i can because it's mine and because i'm allowed to here smell that guys it smells amazing all right here we go for the pour now i'm not expecting a lot out of this because it's a craft lager there's a little bit of haziness into it. That's about it. It pours nicely. It pours clean. And man, does this glass just fit a tall can. It has that snap crackle pop because it is a lager. You could probably hear it. Looks a little hazy. It's not totally see-through, guys. Nice and cold. Aroma. It has a crafty smell. And that's what I like about this. You don't smell corn, but you smell stuff out here that you usually don't smell in a macro beer. I smell a little bit of hops, a little bit of malt. That's all you get, but let's uh, let's dig down for a nice... Oh, I love this glass. I'll be using this glass more often, guys. All right, let's get into this. All right, so it's smooth. It's chuggable. I don't want to chug it. 4.8 you get you get a little bit of hop not much a little bit of malt a uh, little tingle in the back uh, maybe a little bit of pineapple up there no grapefruit because it's not an IP a little bit of pineapple I do get a little bit of pineapple but hey everyone's palate is different but it's refreshing it tastes good and damn it this is what got me into craft beer, Muskoka Craft Lager. I was looking the other day, and I'm like, oh, I did that video already. No, I never. I have some flagship beers that are out there, like Mad Tom. I thought I already did Mad Tom. But it came, uh, I was brought to my attention that I never, and I looked, and no, I never. Now I gotta do Mad Tom. So I am Mad Tom coming. Guys. Get yourself a craft lager, especially, you know, springtime, you just want to chug. It, it, this is a drinkable beer. This is something you just, you can drink 10 of these. 
I'm not saying drink 10 of them. Moderation, eh? Moderation. That came from me. Also, every time you try something new, buy two of them. Because you may not like it the first time. So you have to give it a shot again. Always think about that. Cheers. Like, comment, and subscribe. Get yourself a craft logger. I'm telling you, this will change your life. See you later, guys. Cheers.